do it once more and maybe you won't have to marry a pig farmer and have 10 kids. I don't trust you when you sound like a nice guy. Because you're not. Well, you've got that right. I only trust you when you don't talk. Oh yeah, and when you look at me like you want to get me in bed. Look, when you're not acting, you're great. You've got the face and the body and... You're right. Looking at you, I gotta fight hard to remember what the hell I'm supposed to be doing. Too bad we didn't meet before. Somewhere else. Before. Before you were talent scout. No, Madel, for your future, yeah? And mine? Do it once more, will you? Please. Because if the studio takes you, and they will, I know it. I'll get hired too. Because I'll be your manager. That's just the way it'll work. Okay. Okay. You can do the scene any way you want. I'll just aim the camera at you when you're doing it. I like it that you never give up. Then you'll do it. I'll do it again on one condition. Yes. Whatever it is, yes. I only say my words, not yours. La belle dame sans merci. You got that right. Just be real now, okay? And you can say whatever comes to your mind. It's fine with me. But I'm gonna talk too. And I'm gonna throw some questions at you. You damn well better have some good answers for me. If you start acting, you can walk home. You never told me. What a Shinola. Oh. You're genuinely too much the way your mind works. Shinola is shoe polish. And bread? How's disgusting. Good. Relax now. Keep it real. Get set. Ready? Action! Good evening, sir. What can I get for you? We have served a lot of chili tonight. And then there's our ever popular hot beef with mashed potatoes. All of it drowned in about one gallon of our delicious gravy. I thought this was a drive-in. What are you doing out here? The place to order loudspeaker is broken. Where are you from? I'm a local girl. Can't you tell? Oh, I almost forgot. Tonight, our macaroni and cheese come with a free slice of pizza. Chicago. Wow, Chicago. You know, I could bring you a load of this slop, this server. Or, you could wait until I finish. And then, we can go somewhere. Why would I want to do that? Do you want me to get you a mirror so you can see the way your eyes bulge when you look at me? I'm gonna bring you something. Never mind what. Otherwise, the manager will be all over me. Besides the macaroni and cheese, exactly what are you trying to sell me here? Sell you? Nothing. If you want to eat this junk, go for it. I can bring you to a place where the food isn't 38% fat because I like you and you're from Chicago. How old are you anyway? 
Okay, so you're thinking about it now. I'm past 19, and that means you can take me across the border and no one will come after you with a gun. I'm gonna bring you pie and coffee, but make it last for half an hour. And then, who knows what could happen. I wasn't finished. I wasn't finished. I was right the first time I saw you. You've got it, you hear? You've just got it. Can I believe you? You could believe it. You were very good. You really think I have a chance? When MGM sees your scenes? Definitely. And... You're not mad because I changed the words? Sure, but I'll get over it in a year or two. There's something else. You don't owe me anything, understand? Nothing. If they take you, and if you make it, it's because they like you and they think they can make money with you. Not because of anything I've done. Understand? And we will be together? And stay together? Like in the fairy tales? You're amazing. You're half savage and half practical woman. Ah, and half dreamer. And you are a bully. A liar. And an exploiter of women. But if we can do something about my father, we might have a nice life together. <laughs> <laughs>